Well, hi everybody, my name is George Haramis. I'm the Managing Director for Unison Financial Group, and I'm delighted to talk to you about a couple of things today. One of them being the superannuation area, particularly self-managed super funds, some of the changes that took place in the budget from 2016, and making sure that you've got a, the right advisor to help you with your super and other wealth creation requirements. Why is self-managed super so important and so popular these days? It's a growing industry. There's over $650 billion in self-managed super. Clients, account balances are increasing all the time. So you may have a balance of several hundred thousand dollars or you might have a combined balance of several hundred thousand dollars with your partner. One of the options for you is to establish a self-managed super fund. Now, it provides you greater control in terms of where to direct your investment decisions, i.e. you have the ability to invest in specific assets such as direct shares or direct property. It also provides you greater control in terms of the types of investments, the specific investments you can invest in if you're thinking of buying a property either individually or for your business. A lot of business owners use self-managed super to acquire the property they house their business in. I would encourage you to speak to your accountant or professional advisor to help you in this area because there are some clear guidelines around establishing the fund as well as investing, um, particularly if you're going to borrow through your self-managed super fund. There are some specific requirements in terms of borrowing and making sure that you do that in a prudent fashion. I'm not giving you advice today. That's uh, to be um, directed to, you, to your accountant or your financial advisor but there are specific requirements if you're thinking of borrowing within the self-managed super fund. One of the other points I'd like to recommend that you undertake is to ensure that your fund, your self-managed super fund, you have an existing one, or if you're about to establish one, is to make sure that it's up to date in terms of the budget changes from 2016. A lot of important changes took place last year. Your accountant will, will know all about those. And finally, from um, your accountant's perspective, all accountants who provide strategic advice for self-managed super must now be licensed. It's an, it's an ASIC requirement. So I would encourage you to make sure that your accountant has the appropriate qualifications to give you advice in uh, continuing to provide for your SMSF, establishing a new one, and to make sure that your wealth creation needs are on track. If you'd like any further information or would like to speak to me about some of the things I've um, tabled today, please feel free to call me on 0410-590526. George Harris, 0410-590526. Thank you.